Okay. Welcome, everyone. It has been, well, more or less exactly a week. And Dan the Burr, your title is still saying no stream today. Sunday, Avak. Uh, let me double check that then. Let me go to the page myself. Unfortunately, Twitch does seem to require you to refresh the page in order to see any changes I make. But uh, let's hope that it's okay. Uh, no. On mine, it says Dwarf Fortress stream. Avak playing Slaves to Armok. Two Dwarf Fortress. So, uh, Dan, you must need to refresh your stream page. Ah. Okay, then. Let us resume the epic struggle of our dwarves. Now, what were we up to? Oh, that's right. We had the dwarves chilling out there in the statue garden. That is always a nice thing to see. We were also slowly making our way down here, but we need to clear all of this area out first. Not to mention, we need to do a little bit of mining. Um, we want automating ore and gems. I want to make, automate all of the ore and gems. Actually, I want to automate all of the ore and gems much further down. All the way down, in fact, to the lowest level. We won't go that far. Let's uh, only automate the ore and gems down to this level. There we go. Okay, now you can hit F1 as a shortcut to go straight to the top again, which is very, very bloody useful. Ah, okay. Ah, and summer is now here. All is well in the world of the dwarves. But therein is the problem with any dwarf fort, really. This is how far back we've gone. We're all the way back. We're back to the point where we don't even have the walls. Or the or the stairs down here. We don't have any of the any of the any of the cages or anything. <sighs> My own silly fault though. I should have known, should have saved after after having a migrant wave. That That's the cue. I've got to get into the habit of saving after every migrant wave. But alas, alas, uh, I thought, well, seasonal autosaves, that should be good enough. That is, by the way, the most frequent that you can have the autosave set up to, to, to happen. Alas, we, we have lost much. We have lost an awful, awful lot. Uh, we have even lost so much over here. Uh, right, let's uh, cancel all of the removing ramps. That'll be the first thing we do. Stop trying to remove the ramps for now. There we go. That will help a couple of things. But, uh, yeah, so once more, Dwarf Fortress has thwarted our efforts to make progress by sending me back. I think it's rather rotten of it, really. Right, we want to remove the ramps. From about here. And down to around here. No, maybe. And over there. Okay, that should be alright. That will force things that spawn up top to uh, walk down. And that'll be good enough for now. Ah, well, what, a, what a disappointment. Okay. Let's uh, unpause time, though. Indeed, cool dude. Avax, stay calm and drink tea. Uh, in fact, I, I think I need a dapper sheep myself. There we go. Ah, look how cute it is. I feel better already. <sighs> All right, okay, well, uh, we're going to have to do a fair chunk of work to get back to where we were. My lord. On the plus side, think about the, the, the joyous thing. We haven't accidentally stolen all the belongings from the human caravan because I pressed S wanting to search instead of Q because obviously Q is so much more intuitive than S as the shortcut for searching. Granted, I mean, you know, what I was doing was seizing, so I, I mean, S is certainly intuitive for seizing, but ah, uh, we haven't potentially caused great war. I am... I I will choose to accept this as a good thing. 
Certainly I do. This is a good thing, not a bad thing. Let, let us not let us not wallow in sadness. We're okay. All is well in the world. Uh, got Chris Lopal, okay. Go ahead and start engraving things. Or encrusting things as much as you can. Repeat. Also... You. Engrave. Re she, repeat. And you. Engrave. Finish goods, repeat. Finally. Engrave, finish goods, repeat. I said finally when it wasn't, sorry. There we are. Yeah. Fantastic. Edmund Joystick, please remake me. I don't always remake um, people, generally speaking, 8-bit joystick. It's just potluck. Uh, in fact, I need to take Dark Norak off the uh, off the named list as well from the YouTube name list, but uh, maybe they'll go back on it. But uh, I'll, I'll see what I can do. I know you were very, very excited when you got named. I would feel bad. All right, let's build these beds. Let's get one in there. And as soon as that's finished, we'll build the other one as well. There we go. Right then. Ah. Well, a little bit disappointed with that, but uh, on the whole, it could have been much, much worse. We could have lost the whole save file. I don't actually know if that's even possible, but I'm choosing to believe it is, because then it makes me feel better about only losing about an hour's worth of progress. Bad blanket. Was I removed from my duty as head corpsmith based on my corruptive tendencies yet? No. You have not been removed. You will not be removed. You will be kept there forever and ever and ever and ever. Now... You know what? I think... I think we need to build a floor, construction floor, on each edge. Uh, yeah, we do, but not on that edge. We want the, the floors to be over here. What I'm thinking is that if we want the, the, the bridge to rise up, we, need, we want it to rise away from the direction that the enemies are moving in. So I want the bridge to rise up over here. Because it might actually kill them by squishing them against the roof. Um, oh, well, actually, I don't want that either. I want them to plummet to their deaths far, far below. Mm. Well, in that case, I still want the floor to be on this side. So uh, we're going to be using some Nessus blocks for the floors. There's no access there. Well, I'll just wait for that block to be made first. Also, let's uh, go ahead and build a bunch of traps. We need the traps. Oh, no, that's a trade depot. We want cage traps, as before. Now, we can't put it, place it all the way up there because it's far too close to an edge, but uh, here should be good. And there. There. And down here as well. That'll be good enough down there. Then we want a couple over here too. Uh, probably starting about here. We are going to need more mechanisms. More, more, more mechanisms. Construct all of the mechanisms, machine whisperers. It is your duty. And uh, Afton Flicker, have Avak robbed the humans in this timeline? No. No, you see, perhaps this was the act of the gods of Dapinus. Perhaps the humans were just about to siege us, but the gods of Dapinus realized that it was all just a mistake. The dark Avak had, uh, had distracted me at a crucial moment, and I accidentally pressed the button, thus stealing a lot of goods from the humans. And they were like, no, no this, this, isn't, this isn't your path. This isn't your destiny, Dapper Avak. No, 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 no. No, we, we will revert this, this save to an earlier time, a happier time. Well, you haven't turned into a bloody thief. And that's why we're here. And all is well. 
Uh, let's check up here. How's things going? Have we got any plans to process? Do everything. There we go. Also, we should probably build up the second area up here. So build construction floor. Uh, do we want Nessus blocks? Yeah, we may as well. Now we're going to have to wait for these floors to be made first before we can start doing the rest because currently there's no access point to the other inside walls because that hasn't been built yet. And unlike uh, games like Nomoria where you can just build things without, uh, or, or rather designate them to be built long ahead of time, in this there has to be uh, a sensible path to what you're trying to construct. But let's check on the animals. Are there any animals that I feel like uh, getting rid of? We've got a boar, a, a sow, a ram, a new, uh, you cow, yak, cow bull. Uh, sorry, yak, cow, yak, bull. Uh, a sow or so. I still don't know. Um, stray lamb, another cow, loads of poults, some puppies. Anything else? Baby llama, yak, calf. No, we're actually good. No need to uh, butcher any animals for now. Also, let's go ahead and build construction wall. A bunch of this. Let's try and get this out of the way. So we want granite blocks for this one. Then a little bit more on this side, but we'll leave the last one until later so that uh, no stupid dwarves get stuck outside. Because they are stupid and they will. Stupid dwarves. There's an echidna over there. Aha! The human caravan from Bogil has arrived. Welcome, welcome. What? Me? Steel? No. You must have had a bad dream. How dare you? Right, let's uh, move across finished goods. Now, we should have some fantastic things here if Dr. Moriarty has built them in this timeline as well. Grave Lord Nico, Avak, in all seriousness, maybe you should make an elite fighting force out of migrants who become serfs. Well, the thing is, is our two fully um, enlisted squads of murdersmiths are. That's, that's who got made into murdersmiths. The serfs are the people that are... Uh, currently, I don't want three squads of completely unskilled people training all the time. I would rather have a bunch of people who are actually really good at hauling. Or, well, not good at hauling, but, you know, are responsible for hauling to do that. Because um, right now, most of our murdersmiths do spend their time training, which is great for us, actually. Because they're going to be pretty, pretty good wrestlers when the time comes to, that we're going to need them. But for now... That does mean that we're not really getting much moved around. So hopefully that will uh, change very soon. Let's get all of the nests rebuilt. There we go. Fantastic. And then we should get plenty of new eggs. Okay, Matasapia, are you in here? Yes, you are. Okay, this time... Mat oh, they're still unloading. Okay, well, fine. Damn it. Are you ready now? Mm, I'm not sure. Are, are you ready? Can we trade? Yes! <laughs> okay. We don't want that nest box. No. Donkey, skull, totem. Yes. Yakbull, skull, totem. The crown. Large black opal. Chest bracelet. We've already read all of these things, so we don't need to read them again. There we are. Now, cue to search. Wood. Enter. Okay, I'm, I'm being very, very cautious. Take everything. Except for the, the barrels. Oh, my lord. We don't need any of these. Okay, take that off. Uh, well, actually, we'll take that crutch. Because it just means I don't have to make one. We'll take the leather bin because it's only 60. Wow. Okay, we'll take those two as well. Um, we, you know what? We can afford to take all of these bins. We were not going to take the chests. We just flat out don't need chests. Uh, we'll take the bucket. We won't take the training eggs. Yeah, we'll take all of these. I'm going to set these guys up to be making a lot of stuff. 
um, out of the cloth. We don't need Moon's Nail Icor, thank you very much. We don't really need any barrels, but uh, or Narwhale Blood, really. We'll take the Barley Wine. Won't take that. Nor the Moon's We'll take the Rye Beer. We'll take the Prickleberry Wine. We won't take that. We won't take this. Millet Beer, Foxtail Millet Beer, okay. Fisher Berry Wine. Okay, we'll take all of that. Now Q again and go back to the normal screen. Okay, we'll take the tin bars. Don't need any of these blocks, obviously. And we have got... We, we, the trader's profit is 21,000 dwarf bucks right now. So we can afford to just buy things. A lot of things. I intend to. Um... No, we're not going to take any of these things. Uh, the piccolos and things like that. Just don't need it. Goose cage? Ooh. I'll take the lead cage. Take the zinc cage, too. And that lead cage and that zinc cage. I'm tempted to take the goose cage. It depends if they've got a, a mating pair. A cow? Uh, yeah, okay, we'll take the cow. Uh, parsnip wine? <laughs> Parsnip wine? It's fantastic. Actually, it looks like some of the uh, trees are not wood. So uh, I'll just go back up there and grab all of those. And chestnut. And we'll grab all of these as well. Even if I accidentally sell all of this stuff to him, as long as I've marked out the wood to, to take with us, and I'm actually happy with that. You know what? With the amount of money that we've got, let's just grab these bars as well. Only the cheaper ones, though. Because I just don't think we need the rest. Right, okay. Let's continue down and see what we can find. A, a, a silver scimitar. An iron crossbow. Tempted to take that one. Very tempted, actually. Uh... We've got. A, we can make it ourselves, actually, and it would be training for our our guys anyway. So we won't. We won't grab that just just yet. Uh, no to the bucklers. Large, all of the large clothing. There's no point in taking it because we can't actually do anything with it. We'll take the bag though. Oh, we won't take that one. We'll take this one though. Um, we'll take the sandbag as well, simply because the bag. Well, actually, we're going to buy so much cloth. Why? Why bother? And uh, they're actually, you know, they're, they're not cheap purchases either. Yeah, yellow sand back there. No, don't need any of that. The leather, the cloth, so much cloth, much cloth, such cloth. Turtle, uh, a pond turtle shell figurine. No, thank you. Wow. 1,075 dwarf bucks for 25 iron arrows. I think we can live without. Iron Anvil? Uh, no. But, all of your food. Uh, this is going to be annoying, isn't it? Is there is there some way that I can just mark only the... Uh, probably not. We'll just go through it like this. Sorry about the uh, clicking spam on my keyboard right now. But we need all of this food. I can't believe that we're going to be able to buy out an entire human caravan with this. Practically, except for the stuff that we just don't want. Parsnip plants. Fantastic. Potato, wild carrot plants. We're going to be able to plant loads of things. Strawberries. I do wish that I could just do this all in one go. Fiery, not the sheep meat havoc. Well, the sheep is already dead. We must give its death purpose. This is the only way we can honor the dead sheep. By eating its flesh. Uh, what was I grabbing then? Oh, wool yarn. No, we don't need that. We've just bought loads of stuff. Um, backpack? No, 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 no. Nurse shark leather quiver. You get. We've got loads of cheese. Ooh, Okay. I'm noticing some uh, weapon trap components here, but we'll ignore it. We don't actually need it at all. 
grabbed everything up there? I have. Well, this is turned our face around a little bit. Quite a lot, in fact. You know what? I'll grab these too. There's absolutely no reason not to. Right. Well, you're not getting all of this wonderful stuff. I'm not going to give you 19,000 dwarf packs of profit, trader. I know I may have stolen from you in a past life, but uh, no. Take that away. Take this away. Take that away. I like to imagine the trader is now watching me taking all of the stuff that I'm not going to trade with him off the table with a, an ever saddening expression. Uh, I'll leave you with... You know what? I'll leave you with 5,000 dwarf bucks worth of profit because I did steal from you in a past life. So, let's see. Will you trade? Ah, wonderful. Thank you for your business. Simo seems ecstatic with the trading. There you go. And never let it be said that I stole from you. No, seriously, don't ever say it. In fact, you know what? Give this to Boggill to make up for it. I will see that our leader gets this offering. Good. And that is it. We're done. Ha! That worked well. There we are. You may now move all of the goods from this place. Good times. Good times are for us. Now we need a million bins. Well, maybe not a million, but quite a few. Let's uh, go wooden bin. I would like 20 wooden bins. That may use up an awful lot of our wood. I don't care. I need those bins. Make the bins right now. Chosen one, Avak, clear search. You can't see the total value. I could see the total value. Belial, bah, they are puny humans. Size, everything, Avak. Wow, you've got some awesome dapper emoticons there. My lord. Oh, Lex, Jackal, DF, Hack, Quick Save, Avak. That's a good point. A very good point after all that trading. Let's do that. The game should save the state now. Yes, it looks like the game is saving state. Let us hope that it, rem that it comes back from this.